Hey guys, welcome back to another unboxing video. On today in this video, I'll be unboxing the limited edition figure from the Dragon Ball Super Broly, which includes the Goku with the staff, which is funny because I didn't even see his staff in the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie, so it's kind of weird having a figure of his staff when he didn't use it in Dragon Ball Super Broly, or it was never even present to begin with. But I know I'm late on this one, but I just decided to get it because I don't have it personally. And so it looks really neat from the looks of the box. So without further ado, I'm gonna go to showcasing the box and then go into unboxing the figure and giving me a review for you guys. And there we are guys, base from Goku from the Dragon Ball Super movie, the limited edition, since it is the 20th film. So I have this figure, came out really, really good. I just don't like how big the base is. I know they could have made it to where he only has a stand, like most of the Grandistas do. Even though I know this isn't a Grandista, but um, this could have had much more potential if it just had the stand, but it has the base. So it takes up a lot of room. I feel like they do this to encourage people to buy acrylic bases. And if you guys don't know, those acrylic bases, acrylic stands, they have it to where it minimizes the, the space. So you can have your figures closer together. So instead of having such a big circular base, what it does is it just takes the diameter between this foot right here to this one. It just takes up the width from here to here. It just takes up that much space and so instead of having this excess this extra right here all it does is just take up measures it between here and from here around his boots and then it just makes it from there so acrylic bases are a good thing to have i do not have any sadly but i am looking into it the acrylic bases because it just saves up more room and you have more space with those but yeah guys this figure came out really really nice it's just simple goku um before his battle with broly and it's just really nice to see. We should just make this um, come with a stand, but either way, still a nice figure, just simple Goku in his clothing. 
and just holding his staff. Not much details, not much, you know, too detailed, but detailed enough to where it stands alone as a great figure. So as you can see from the details in his muscles, just original, nothing too extreme about this Goku. And his face just makes it all the better. I feel like they made the, the face perfect. And so it fits this Goku. I know I, they kind of made him more cartoonish in the Dragon Ball Super Mo Broly movie, but I think it fits him really well. So let me give you guys a quick close up of him. So here we have Goku, just great, holding the staff. His face, more childish like. His hair, not much sculpt into the hair, not much craftsmanship, but just enough to make it pass by as a great figure. Of course, I always have the symbol on his clothing. Oh, for some reason to me, it just looks pristine, just so great. But I know they could have done way better, but this is just enough for this Goku figure. This is really enough just for this one. Just the hair, see there's not much, not much detail in the hair. The muscles, contraction of the muscles. There's a pink defect right there. That button and that guy's really great figure. Final thoughts, like this figure. Again, I wish they just made a stand. Just shows Goku original, base form, nothing too extreme. Highly recommend this figure. It took me a while just to get this one. And I'm glad to have gotten it already for you guys. So I'm glad to have this in my, in my collection. I don't really have a Goku in his orange clothing with the staff. I have the Goku in his blue gi from the GT, which I previously unboxed as Super Master Starpies, the manga dimension, and then just a 2D. So. I highly recommend you guys go check that out as well. See you guys. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed me unboxing this Goku, the 20th film anniversary of Dragon Ball Super Broly movie. <laughs> so yeah, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And then I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you, guys.